hi guys mm -hmm. next up i don't remember ordering because i have one of these so i don't know why i would have ordered this it's currently on offer as i'm filming this so thanks for that hi everyone welcome back to my channel or if you're new here hi my name is shab and thank you for joining if you are new here please hit the subscribe button i'd really appreciate it and i'm just a small youtuber so you know every little helps give the video a thumbs up if you like this kind of thing i've been bit so i've got this thing where mosquitoes literally love me and i don't know what it is i think it's the freckles and yeah i've just been bit on my bit on my leg I noticed one was following me around and it's got me. It's got me. So if you see me scream during the video, you know why, because I can hear it buzzing because it's found me again. So today I've got two unboxings, both from Latest in Beauty and I actually can't remember what I chose. So this is going to be really exciting for me. The CEW Beauty Awards Edit 2022. I purchased mine, it was £36 and you could choose six products in there. It's currently on offer as I'm filming this, so thanks for that. Currently on offer for £28, so if you are thinking of getting one, then yeah, go for it. I have got a Latest in Beauty July box, which again, you get to choose the products that you add into your box, which I think is fab. It ships quite quick. I did get it within a week, I would say. The Latest in Beauty monthly box is £12.95. It is my first time trying the Latest in Beauty monthly box. I don't know what it's going to be like. I don't actually know the size of the products, but we're going to find out. Okay, so we've got the monthly box. I'm guessing it is because it says nothing on it. And then we've got the CEW Beauty Awards box. So yeah. I'm excited. I forgot what I ordered. I would say if you are interested and you're um and now in about it, I'd be quick because basically the products sell out, unfortunately. So as I was actually ordering a box, the first product that I wanted sold out. However, I'm very excited because I think it's in the look fantastic box for July. So it doesn't matter. But I found that out after it. Anyway, what should we start off with? Should we do the monthly? Let's do the monthly. Is it six products or is it more? Oh, what is that? Okay, ruining it for myself. I completely forgot. I now remember. It comes in a box like this. There isn't a great deal of packaging in here. There could definitely be more just to keep it a bit more secure. It is all a little bit loose, but whatever. So the first thing that jumped out at me is this because... I thought I was only getting one and I've got more than one. So I chose to put in here uh, the Advanced Collagen Supplement. So it's five grams of marine collagen, eight active ingredients, summer fruits flavour, and it's a food supplement. So it's from the brand Known. And I've never tried a, a collagen supplement before. So I was very intrigued. I, I've seen a lot of people, you know, taking them my friend does pretty much every day i'm pretty sure thought i'd give it a go i did think i was only getting one sachet but i have one two three four five six seven so that's nice because you can try it for a week and see if you can you know see any difference so this says liquid food supplement with hydrolyzed marine collagen vitamins minerals botanicals and natural sweetener it does say for adults only take one sachet per day do not exceed the recommended intake to consult a doctor if you've got any medical condition taking any medication pregnant or breastfeeding a food supplement should not substitute a varied diet or healthy lifestyle not suitable for children under 12 years old not suitable for vegetarians. It's got vitamin C, vitamin E, pan... pan there we go, again. Pantothenic acid, vitamin A, marine collagen, pine bark extract, flaxseed oil, bilberry extract, four to one. I don't, I've never even heard of that. I don't know. It says 200 PG. What is PG? Am I all right? Anyway, 
there we go so yeah we've got seven sachets of that so i'm going to give it a go for a week and see how i feel like i said i've never tried a, a collagen supplement before so i'm not really sure how it's going to go down but i'm excited am i supposed to put these in the fridge store in a cool dry place away from children next up we've got the saint tropez self tan and this is the lux wit creme mousse it's a 50 mil which is a nice size and i've never tried the lux whipped creme mousse before so i thought i'd give it a go i like saint tropez anyway it's usually not dark enough for me i'm not gonna lie but doesn't say what shade it is and whether it's dark or not. Infused with niacinamide and a hyaluronic acid and vitamin E. So yeah, sounds very nice for your skin as well. So I'm looking forward to trying that out. Next up, I don't remember ordering because I have one of these. So I don't know why I would have ordered this. I feel like, um, oh, did you get it in a set? I think you got it in a set okay i'll take it back i'm sorry so yeah i do remember now so this is a dual sided velvet lux applicate emit uh prep and maintain patent protected interesting dual sided mitt is a luxurious a velvety texture that works with all saint tropez formulations to ensure a streak free finish and stain free hands every time after each use gently hand wash in cool soapy water and leave to dry naturally fabulous so yeah i got them in a little set so that's cute Next up, we've got the Colab Dry Shampoo Overnight Renew. Now, I've never tried this before. I've never heard of it before, but it sounds really cool. So, do you ever go to bed and think, I've got greasy hair, I should really wash it, but I'm too tired, I'm not going to wash it? That's what this is for. So, basically, uh, it says, amazing overnight detox formula, save water. So, it's a 50 ml. So basically, you put this on at night time and then wake up in the morning with rejuvenated hair. And I, I don't know about you, but I really need that because many occasions I go to bed thinking I definitely should have washed my hair and I haven't. And then I don't wash it in the morning either. So, yeah. Works while you sleep to absorb oil and cares for your scalp. So you wake up to dreamy, revitalised locks. Absorbs impurities, conditions scalp, works while you sleep and calming scent. I'm excited about that. Really excited about that. That is right up my street. Next up, we've got the Amy Naturally Kind Glow and Bright Illuminating Moisturiser. I feel like this was a free gift. Instant and 24 hour hydration. Brightens and smooths and dermatologist approved, formulated for dull, lacklustre skin, including sensitive skin. 96% natural and it's a 15ml. That's what that looks like. I have heard of uh, Amy Brand, but I don't have anything from it, actually. I've got a funny feeling that this was a free gift because I can't remember that you picked seven products. I feel like that's a bit random. But anyway... I've got that. Okay, next up, we've got the Beverly Hills Formula Perfect White Toothpaste, and this is the gold edition. I have heard about this toothpaste, that it's quite good for whitening. Uh, I've never tried it before, so I thought I'd give this a go, and this is the 10 mil. Next up, we've got the Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula with Vitamin E natural bronze body lotion and it's gradual tan for all skin tones it says with natural vegetable based tanning ingredients and it gives you 24 hour moisture uh this is a 20 mil and i'll be really honest with you i've seen this and i was like oh my god palmas i haven't had anything from palmas for a long time and i love the smell of this stuff this is the coconut oil formula and yeah anything that smells like coconut i actually really don't like coconut anything like a bounty a bounty is illegal basically uh but yeah i really like the smell of coconut anything like body sprays whatever gorgeous holidays amazing so yeah i got this to give it a go because i feel like i ne neglected palms a little bit so yeah nice I definitely didn't need two tans, did I? And last but not least, I think this is the most exciting thing in the monthly box. Can I just say how much of a good deal is this? It's £12.95. I feel like it's really good. Next up, 
We've got a palette from Barry M and I have never had an eyeshadow palette from Barry M. So I seen this at the top and I snapped it up. So this is the Wildlife Eyeshadow Palette with a little bee on the front. Gorgeous. Over the last 50 years, British insect and wild animal populations have plum plummeted. A recent report described the UK as among the most nature depleted countries in the world. Insects are vital to a healthy ecosystem. We literally couldn't live without them. But 41% of the world's insect species are now facing extinction. Extinction. Barry M's British Wildlife Collection was created to help protect some of the UK's most threatened wildlife species and habitats. Oh. And how pretty is it? And there's a little bee on here and on here. And on the on on the browns here, which means I probably can't touch it because I don't like to ruin the pictures. But yeah, how pretty is that? It's got some nice matte shades. It's very wearable, very everyday go-to kind of colours for me. That is such good value. So you've got a palette. We've got the Saint Tropez tanning set with a mitt. The overnight dry shampoo. The Palmer's Natural Bronze Body Lotion, which is going to smell amazing. The Amy Glow and Bright Moisturiser. The Beverly Hills Perfect White Toothpaste. And seven sachets of the collagen supplement. That is fab. I love that. So they do update their products every month as well. I think I picked good options there, to be honest with you. Next up, we've got the CEW 2022 Beauty Awards box. And again, you get to pick what you put in the box. First up, we've got Murad. This is the Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum. It is a 10 mil. And yeah, it's for dark spots. Look at the lady here, you can see. I don't massively struggle with dark spots. It depends how stressed and how tired I am. Um, and then my skin kind of looks a bit bleh. But I just thought I like your ad anyway. It says Environmental Shield Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum. Doesn't really say much else to be honest with you, and it kind of is a bit self-explanatory, isn't it? AM and PM, after cleansing, massage evenly over face, neck and chest. And then use a Murad sunscreen during the day, it says. Okay. It's got AHA in it, which um, can leave your skin susceptible more so to uh, sun damage. So yeah, that's why it says that. Oh, I thought it was just a bit of a a plug on using their sunscreen but yeah there you go some nice brands in this box by the way next up this is a really good size this is from naturals ayumi um, apologies if i'm pronouncing that wrong sandalwood and pink clay mask face mask gentle exfoliation and hydration for dry and sensitive skin shea butter sea kelp babusa Babusa and avocado oils. It's cruelty free and vegan. A creamy rich mask with finely powdered pink clay to gently draw out skin impurities and safely deep cleanse even the most sensitive of skin. I just really wanted a new pink clay mask and it's funny because I, I've ordered another one because I completely forgot that I picked this. So I've ordered a new one from Revolution Skincare as well but Never mind, it's fine, whatever. I just really wanted a new pink clay mask because I've not got any at the moment. And I love these for clearing out your, your pores and everything. So this is 100 mil. It's a really good size. That is going to last me for ages. So I'm looking forward to trying that. I haven't heard of that brand before, but I always say that. I probably have and just took no notice. So. Next up, we've got uh, another skincare product. This is from Ren Clean Skincare and it is the Radiance Glow and Protect Serum. World's first tube and reclosable break-off nozzle made with recycled aluminium. Recyclable sample and 100% recycled aluminium. Okay, thank you. Radiance, Radiance. Say hello to our recyclable samples. Reduce waste. So is it just like a one-time use thing because you snap off the top and then that's it or what? How big is it? It doesn't say. 
to use AM and PM, gently press with fingertips onto a cleanse face, massage in circular upwards motion motions until fully absorbed. If using in AM, please follow up with SPF. Have you got AHA in you as well? Everything's got AHA in this these days. Just actually say how big it is. How bizarre. Anyway, I really like Ren skincare. So I thought I'd give this a go. Never tried it before. It says it's vegan, by the way. Suitable for sensitive skin as well. Next up, we've got a mascara. This is the MAC Stack Mascara. It is a little mini version. Super Stack Mega Brush. Infinite Build Volume and Length Mascara. I mean, look at this before and after picture. What a joke. I have heard good things about this and I've never tried it before. Petal shaped bristles, hug and coat lashes from root to tips. Super Stack Mega Brush, our biggest brush for volume at first swipe. Uh, this is a 2.1 mil, which is very random. Look how cute it is. But yeah, I've heard good things about that mascara, to be honest. So I'm looking forward to giving that a go. Again, nice way to try it. Obviously getting it in a box like this. Next up. We've got Paula's Choice. Now, you've probably seen this everywhere because at the moment it seems to me that everyone's talking about it. I've never tried it like everything else in this box and that's why I chose them. So, this is the Paula's Choice Exfoliate Skin Perfecting 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliant Salicylic Acid for all skin types. It unclogs and shrinks in large pores. Smooths an even skin tone, and this is a 30 ml. Once or twice daily, apply over face and neck. Do not rinse. For daytime, always follow with a sunscreen because it's got AHA in it, obviously. Like a little, that's a bit, bit of a strange, strange thing, but okay. It's like a little dabber. You just put that on a cotton pad and then put it over your face and it, you don't rinse it, you just leave it on. I'm really looking forward to using that because people have been raving about this, raving. Apparently it's really, really good. Last but not least, I have a little mini NARS blusher and I think you can probably guess what shade this is because it's probably the most famous NARS blusher. I do have Orgasm X, which is a different shade. This is the original Orgasm. There you go. How stunning is that? I mean, this this blusher is pretty iconic. I've never had one. So I seen this on there and I was like, okay, I'm having that. Thank you very much. There we go. That's the last of the CEW Beauty Awards Edit 2022. This is my selection of products. It is more expensive than the monthly one. They are premium luxury uh, brands. It's definitely got a higher value than I actually paid for it. I'm really happy with my choices. I'm so pleased to have this in my life right now. That is the end of my latest in beauty unboxing. Please let me know down below what you think and did you get one of these boxes? What did you pick? And I think I'm going to keep my eye out for the August latest in beauty monthly box. And I, I think I'll be giving that a go. Um, I did recently put on a latest in beauty collection limited edition box, which was the iconic eyebrow pencil, which is fab. I absolutely loved that box. It was the summer essentials box. And after I got that, I was like, okay, I need more latest in beauty boxes. So yeah. Here we go. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. As always, thanks for the, all the support. And I'll leave all my details down below, uh, all my other socials and stuff like that. Give me a follow over there if you're not already. And I do also sneak little heads up. I do have a giveaway coming up soon. It will be over on my YouTube channel. It will be a YouTube video coming up and I've got another really gorgeous bundle of beauty goodies to give away. Keep your eye out for that and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!